Hello everyone, this is Dan. I am uh, sending you this video to, for you to take a look at. Uh, you will need to download um, to uh, for Computer Science 1436, 1415, the uh, latest uh, Microsoft uh, uh, Visual Studio C++, the um, professional edition with it. I'm going to show you where to uh, do this. So, um, go to any of your, I recommend Google, um, browser with it. Find your, you know, open up any browser with Google. You will need an internet connection for this thing. And what you need to do is, I'm just going to use the text pad. Uh, yeah, this is what I would use as words to search is the MS space Visual Studio Express C++ exp uh, I'm sorry, uh, C++ uh, that's what I have. Um, uh, 2015 is the version. So if you can please type this into your search engine, which I have here. So I'm going to paste this. Uh, I'm going to actually paste this in here for you to see. It's going to uh, search it, and it comes up as the first link after you type those exact words in there. Uh, once you've done that, you just right mouse click on it, open up a tab. Uh, which should get you to one of these tabs over here. And I like for you to do this one right here is the Visual Studio Community with it. So once you do that, uh, it will take you to this page right here. Okay. Uh, what I like for you to do is make sure you have a place that you want to save this file called vs underscore community underscore en u.exe with it and you click on save it would save it to wherever your location or where you have it so it takes a few seconds depending on where you're at and you're in it speed with it as well and I'm gonna again I'm gonna pause this and I'm gonna let it download and then I'm gonna pick up where we go from here okay so hold on by the way in case you get to this right here this page or this page will get you the same place by the way either the download community 2015 make sure it's visual studio express you can use the express version it is free uh, for students and everybody with it the professional edition is what you have to pay so use the express version for this course 2015 that's all you need to do so I'm gonna pause and then where we'll take so I, what I have done is I have downloaded this file. Here it is right here. Here is that .exe file that I just shared with you. I'm going to click on it. I'm going to run it uh, from here. And I'm going to install this uh, up to a point and then I'm going to pause the, the recording in a second. But give it a second um, as this is going to load up the, uh, the, the option for me to pick with it. So it's, it's loading it. So give it a second. It has kind of like a little banner, Visual Studio. And when you come to here with it, just take the default setting. Choose the type of installation that you want. Uh, just take the default settings with there. We'll, we will have, uh, and again, this is, I have a 64-bit a or, um, or uh, with it, or you, depending on what version you have, uh, it requires about 8 gigabytes across all drives with this thing. So make sure you have the proper drive. And you click on Install. And this is going to take about 15, 20 minutes, I would say, depending on how what processor and how much RAM you have and all the stuff with it. Uh, it's going to run by itself with it. So I'm going to let this run. And this is a good time to go to the refrigerator and grab yourself a drink or, or a cold or hot drink while you're waiting on this thing. Okay, so it's going to take a few minutes with this. All right, I'm going to pause. I'll check back with you in a few seconds. Hi, folks. Uh, I hope you uh, took a little break. After you install the um, the, the Visual Studio, the Express, the, um, the Community 2015, this is what it should look like. Um, I'm going to restart my computer, and it's going to take a few minutes. So I'm going to pause. I'm going to get back with you, and this is what you should get. Okay. So. Um, so let me pick up where we were at right now is that I installed, I restarted my computer, picked up all the changes and everything with it, and I'm going to go ahead and fire up and start the Visual Studio on my Visual Studio 2015 ribbon at the bottom here. You see this little ribbon here. So you click on it, and you're going to have it load. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, um, get it to connect. Uh, with it and per, you know, per, uh, kind of walk you through the next few minutes with this uh, uh, doing the hello world with it as well. So, so 
Give me a second here. Let me pause the recorder for a moment. So when you get to the screen, it's up to you. I don't have anything to sign up here, so I'm, you know, not now, maybe later. So I'm not going to join that. And I'm going to do this as a start the, with a familiar environment. Just keep it as general as the pull down for it as well. Um, and you know, I I just keep it as blue. Choose your color theme setting. Very traditional with it. I'm just going to start with the default settings with this. Again, this, this is your first time loading this. It's going to take a few minutes, so I'm, I'm just going to pause, okay? Pause the recorder right now. So, once you load the Visual Studio 2015, it looks like this. There's several ways you can start a new project. You can click on New Project here on the front page. I always like to go to File, New, New Project for me. So, um, it's at this point I'm going to stop right here and I'm going to, I'm going to uh, end this video right here on how you download and install so the second part I'm going to pick up is going to be totally different uh, that how to set up with this okay so this will conclude the, all the downloading of the Visual Studio 2015 alright